Today's guest is certainly not new to us. An engineer by profession, the current serving principal secretary of the Ministry of Transport and Infrastructure, Engineer Musonic. Thank you for joining us. Thank you, thank you very much yes. and, and welcome again. And um, um, Yes. Of course I'm in charge of um, transport and infrastructure and especially State Department of Infrastructure. And, um, I think I'll approach it uh, from two perspectives. That is on my personal capacity and also in terms of my official capacity. Now, as engineer, uh, Mosonic, uh, my background is actually as an engineer and registered engineer uh, with the two institutions, that is IEK and also EBK. Um, my background is, uh, is engineering, electrical engineer, and uh, I've been in ICT sector for uh, more than 20 years, and then I've been worked in government and also in private sector. And uh, I would say at this point in time, of course, uh, I'm in charge of um, infrastructure, spare road infrastructure. Uh, on the other aspect, of course, um, uh, this would be very uh, interesting, especially for engineers. Uh, being a registered, quite often they ask what would be the other kind of discipline. So also I have a business uh, degree, so I have an uh, MBA, and also apart from that, I've studied MSc in strategy and also MSc in finance. So these will be able to look at, uh, especially projects in different kind of perspectives, which is our main core business uh, in this uh, in this ministry, executing most of those uh, roads projects which we do. Now, apart from that, of course, various kind of trainings, especially in management, uh, both local and overseas market. I mean, overseas countries. So again, I think with that kind of background, that shows actually that uh, uh, to be able to face the kind of challenging. Uh, competitive environment in which we are at this uh, point in time. Now, on my official capacity as the principal secretary within the ministry, I'm in charge overseeing uh, road construction in this country. And uh, when we talk about road construction, we look at from various uh, coordinating uh, agencies. We have various roads within um, uh, rural areas. We have urban roads. And then, of course, we have Kenya National Highways. And all these fit in the portfolio of the type of roads which we do. Uh, in the ministry, uh, case across the country. Now, the current road network is close to about 161,000 kilometers, and this is what we call classified roads. That is from class A, B, C, and D, and then there are some partly which are also uh, classified. And I would say, at this point in time, actually, that kind of class, that kind of network has grown over the last few years. So we are going to do another inventory, which I would think actually. It will foot 161 to over 200,000 kilometers uh, within uh, in the, in the current road network. Mm -hmm. Now, apart from that, rolling of uh, infrastructure, what we do is we look at um, uh, standards. And I think this is a topical issue probably which I'll discuss later. In the program, we look at the standard to make sure that we build the roads which conform to safety and uh, minimize the risk uh, to motorists as we, draw, as, we, as we roll out the roads uh, throughout the country. Mm -hmm. 